Hi, Lydia. I'm sorry I couldn't come around last week, Thursday. Something came up. I'm trying to help you here. What else should I do? I don't know what to do. trying to help? How does this help? Haven't you done enough? You conniving, backstabbing son of a bitch. Lydia. I gave you everything. I gave you my life. And you stole it from me. At least you are alive. <gasps> you call this leaving? Kachi, I ask you, you call this leaving? I am a shadow of myself. I am being drugged day in, day out, every single day. I don't get to see my friends or my family. Tell me, how does this help? If I hadn't testified, it would have been to the gallows. And it would have been a much better life. Enough. Show some gratitude. Kachi, let me tell you something. The most dangerous animal is a silent, smiling woman. That I'm silent doesn't mean I'm stupid. I'm waiting for the right time. And that, Kachi, should scare the hell out of you. What's the deal? <laughs> Don't you trust me? It's me now. <laughs> yes. Okay. Uh, when I get to the office, I will send you an email of the details. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. No problem. All right. Bye. Uh, driver, uh, take a left turn. I want to see someone before we get to the office. Yes, boss. I'm sorry. I'm fine. It's, 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 it's fine. Are, you okay? Are you okay? Yes, I'm good. I'm so sorry. Um, can I drop you off? No, for it's you? fine. I, I need to go. No, wait, wait, hold on. Are you sure you're fine? Let me just drop you off. I said I'm fine. What exactly is wrong with you rich people? So you think because you have a car you can intimidate me? You I, I nearly don't... run me over and that's what you have to say? You want to drop me off? If you have money, go to the orphanage now and donate money to them. Please excuse me, Jerry. Oh! Why are you... <laughs> <clears throat> are you laughing at me? Who, me? Yes, are you laughing at me? No. I... Are you sure you... Hold on. Are you sure you don't want me to drop you off? We can buy another shoe on the way. Please? Get in the car. Reverse the car.
sent for me, boss. Yes. Any update? Shoot. She's single, not single. I mean, she's... Clifford? She has a boyfriend, sort of. Is it worth it? Set it up. Yes, boss. Should I drive back to the office, sir? No. Let's wait a while. She's here. Yeah. Hello. Huh? Excuse me. Hi. Are you stalking me? Stalking you? Oh, I was. I was just in the neighborhood. How are you? Stay away from me. Hey, you didn't even tell me your name. Hey, my name is Kachi. Can I be your friend? I just want to talk to you. Let's go. No! What's wrong, honey? Did you forget something in the market? You? Oh, I told you. You know what? It's fine. Let's just have chicken. Don't worry about the fish. Java, let's go. I'm starting the trip. No, now. don't. Baby, you can't do this outside. Don't call me that. Okay, you know what? When we get home, we'll talk about it, alright? Java, start the trip. So, madam, should I? No, please. Don't. I don't even know who. Uh, Java, my wife is mad at me, okay? So just start the trip. Let's just go, okay? Hey, baby, where are you going? Hey, bro. Hi.
are you alright? Yeah. You want to talk about it? You know I've got your back, right? I know. But trust me, this is one of the things I'm gonna handle on my own. And trust me, I'll be fine. Okay. You'll be fine, bro. In case you're hungry, there's food in the microwave. Thank you. The food is really nice here. Uh, hello, sir. Uh, hello. It doesn't matter. We nice can food. eat anywhere else. <laughs> let's go. Right, let's go. Oh, and uh, you forgot your shoes. Uh, your shoes. Your shoes. Uh, babe, these are your shoes. What no. are you doing with your shoes? No, no, they're not. These are your shoes. I know your shoes. These are your shoes. They're not my shoes. Uh, they are not your shoes. Who is he? What is he doing with them? I don't know him. But he has his shoes. Oh. <laughs> now I understand. The reason you don't want us to eat here is because when we walked in here, you probably knew him. And let me guess, you've been screwing him behind my back. What right? are you saying, Ruben? I don't even know who this guy is. You don't is. know who this guy is, but he has your shoes. They're not my shoes. My, my shoes are at, my, my shoes. At, 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 at your place? Oh, okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. She's no, 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 they are not at my place. I, I threw them away. Whoa. I'm not lying, I swear. My, my shoes got twisted and it broke. I, I had to throw them away. I, I didn't. You just shut up. You don't need to lie to me. You're not even good at it. I'm not lying. He's lying. But I haven't said anything. <laughs> Say something. <laughs> about what? Your shoes? About what happened to my shoes? <laughs> Lydia, some seconds ago you just said you don't know this man. And now you're asking him to say something. It's someone you just denied you don't know about your shoes. I don't... You, 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 you sound pathetic. I'm out of here. Ruben, wait! Ruben! 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 Ruben, listen to me! Please! Ruben, let me explain to you! Ruben, please! Wait! Ruben, please! Ruben! Ruben! Ruben, please, it's not what you think. I don't know him. I swear, Ruben, please. Ruben, don't leave me here, please. Ruben, Ruben. Ruben, please. Ruben, 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 Ruben. <laughs> what a way to meet. Mm -hmm. I know. And it's been wonderful ever since. Mm. He's the best thing that ever happened to me. Mm. And I think we should drink to that. <laughs> <laughs> so catchy. Mm. Is she the one? <sighs> I don't know. 
maybe we should ask her. <gasps> hey, babe. <laughs> what do you say? We give this up. Uh, yes, yes, story, yes, huh? yes, yes, yes. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Hello. Cheers to the latest couple in town. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> oh my goodness. So can my fiance sit down there? Sit? No, I can't sit. I'm excited. I need to call everyone. My friends. All oh, my friends. I need to hear this. I'm engaged. Oh my god. Where's my phone? Let me get my phone. Let me get my phone. I'm right back. Ah! <laughs> Wakey, 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 Get off. Wake up. <laughs> wake up. You and who? Get up, Joe. Get up. Ah! <laughs> Hi, Gideon. Hi, Lydia. I thought to bring you breakfast. Um, I'm sure you will enjoy it. Um, Gideon, it's quite embarrassing, don't you think? Please, don't be. It is my pleasure. You know what? Um, why don't you uh, sit here? Bed. Enjoy Gideon's breakfast and I'll go fix one for myself. Well, um, I'm sure she wouldn't mind sharing it with you. Thanks for checking out for my wife, but I'll fix my breakfast. I guess he just transferred the same love to you. Yeah, but he brought me breakfast in bed. Isn't that meant to be your job? Well, I didn't sign that on a marriage contract. <laughs> just joking. <laughs> I'm sorry, okay. Look, Gideon is harmless, okay? An ex-convict. Still harmless. I told you it was all an accident. He did the time for a crime he did not commit. Okay. I love my brother so much. And that's all he has ever asked of me. Please don't make him feel left out, okay? For my sake. It's okay. Time to shower. I'm going to work.
Hey, bro. Hey, How you doing? Hi, babe. Hi, babe. Yeah. What have you been up to? Nothing, really. Oh, okay. You know you should um, go out more often. I think so, too. Maybe I can come over to the office. There must be something for me to do over there. Babe! Hey, baby. Hi. Uh, okay, go upstairs, freshen up, and then I'll be served soon, okay? And then after dinner, what else? <laughs> Let's have dinner first. Okay. <laughs> Off you go. All right. Serious. What? Don't come here, come to bed. Yeah. Well, of course I want it. You know, I always. I can, I can get it to you twice. Why were you distracted? What? Bed, baby. Uh, so, you want some pie for me too? Hi. Oh, come on. <laughs> hey, babe, what's what's wrong? Don't tell me this one wrong with the dog. There you go. Can you come to bed? You owe me two kisses. <laughs> Hello. Can I get my kiss now? Girlfriend, it's just that I've not seen anyone visit you here. <laughs> I'm sure Gideon has uh, other things to focus on other than hovering around women. Like what? I mean, he sits around the house doing nothing. Oh, <laughs> it's just that I feel like everyone needs a companion. You know, someone you can jiggy, 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 jiggy with. <laughs> It was just uh, a suggestion. Um, okay, uh, I'll, I'll take my leave now. All right, bye. Um, bro, mechanic will be coming to fix the car. I need you to help me keep an eye on him, okay? Okay. Um, I'm working on getting you something doing, okay? Fixing cars? 
No, I mean, something good, something legit. I only need some time. You're still here? Yes, sir. Uh, I'm going now. Okay. So. Hi, Lydia. Hi. Listen, darling. Yeah. I was thinking, I need to go out there and look for a job. I've got the degree that I need. Okay. Can you hold that thought till I get back? I'm not about to become a housewife, sitting at home doing nothing. Lydia, please hold the thought till I get back, okay? Mm. Have a nice day. Take care of yourselves. All right. something from the fridge. And I am leaving now. Understand. I can't continue to live like this. Your brother is creepy. He does crazy things. I've told you that Gideon is harmless. Are you sure prison was the only place he went to? Because he sure acts like he's been to a psychiatric ward before. Have you been to prison before? Like a real prison. The condition there is terrible. You can't go in and come out the same way. There is nothing wrong with my brother. He's just suffering from PTSD. And he'll be fine. All he needs is love. Maybe you should stay at home more often. You'll understand what I'm saying. Hi, Gideon. What's, what's up? I don't know what's happened. Um, if the heater stopped working, I was wondering if I could use the... No, you can't use my bathroom. No! Use the guest room or something. Or better still, go to the kitchen and warm up some water to use. You can't use my bathroom. It's private. Uh, uh, I won't take so long. I'll be quick. I, I, are you seriously going to consider this? Uh, uh, you know what, babe? Just um, let's talk. Let's just let's just talk. Hey, do your thing and be fast about it. Let's uh, just uh, don't worry. Just just come. Let's talk. Let's, let's talk. Okay. I mean, seriously, Kachi, what the hell is wrong with you? How can you let him use our bathroom? Keep your voice down. No, I will not. How can you let him do that? How can you allow it? I said, keep your voice down. <sighs> the thing is, Gideon and I have always shared everything. We love each other so much and we've made up our minds that we'll share everything and can do anything for one another. Including letting him use our bathroom? The thing is, you have no idea what Gideon and I have gone through. We grew up with our parents. I didn't even know who my father was. He was, he was dead before I was born. And my mother, she left too. Babe. And it's so sad. It's really sad because 
he didn't took care of me, he protected me. He was like my father, my mother, my everything. It's okay. I feel so bad because I didn't do anything for him. I wish I could do something for him. I just, I just want to, just want him to be the big brother he is. I just want him to be happy. It's not your fault. <laughs> I feel so terrible. It's okay. You don't have to cry. Don't, don't be sad. He doesn't deserve the life he's living. He was sent to jail at the age of 18 on him and made him a shadow of himself. That is not my brother. He, he's not my loving brother. I'm sorry. I, it's okay. Sorry for the inconvenience. I was really cold and I needed a hot bath. It's okay. We'll fix your heater tomorrow. Good night. Good night. needs to be fixed. You can't keep using our bathroom. I wasn't planning to. I got it fixed. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Um, do you want me to get you a lunch? No, I'm not hungry. Okay. Is everything alright? Ah, yes. Everything is fine. I'll just leave. I mean, what if he's on drugs? What if that's what's been wrong with him the whole time? Gideon doesn't use drugs. And how would you know? Listen, read up on the effects of drugs on people and you'd realize that maybe, just maybe that's what's been wrong with him. Kachi, at least look into this. Look into it. I mean, I, I don't want to wake up one morning and realize that he's overdosed himself. The police will actually blame us. Can I walk, please? This is your brother we're talking about. It's important. Lydia. Gideon doesn't use drugs. And I'm sure he's not going to be happy with you if he finds out that this is what you think about him. But I just and not think... everyone who goes to jail cooks and smokes these drugs. Don't make him feel like a bad influence or some rotten egg or something. The man has been through a lot, okay? Kachi. Kachi. I know what I'm talking about. Look into it. Just look into it.
So, babe, what has been your biggest sexual fantasy? Come on, say it. This is not the place or the time. Stop. Are you shy? No. Then say it. Kachi, stop. Please. Please? Kachi, stop. It must have been something really weird. Like having sex in a tunnel, you know, the whole echo thing. <laughs> Stop! Or having sex on the rooftop. Amazing. I know you're crazy, you're my wife. Catch you, what's <laughs> wrong with you? Stop! Oh, I know it. Having sex with a horse. <laughs> sorry, sorry. It's I'm not even funny. Sorry, I was just, I was just playing. But I mean, the horse is not that bad. The tree sound. A threesome? It has always been my sexual fantasy. A threesome. Oh. Okay. Oh. I think you should do it. It's not that bad. Kachi. Have you ever had a threesome? Uh... You know what? I've got something to do upstairs. Um, are you coming? Yes. Okay. I'm going. Okay. Uh, anyway, bro, I'll see you later. I'm gonna check on something upstairs, okay? Uh, You know, I was just joking down there, right? Sweetie. I was just joking there. Babe, talk to me now. Please talk to me now. Babe. Can I talk to you? I want to join the company. Um, we have talked about this already. It's not possible. Not possible? Or not possible for you? Uh, Gideon, the company has an image to protect. And don't get me wrong, but nobody is going to invest in a company that has an ex-convict as a CEO. Fine, I will start small. I will start from the mill room. Anyway, I will work. I want to earn my money. But I told you that I'm going to look for a job for you. I'm speaking to some of my friends already. I can work at your friend's company and not yours. Well, my company has no opening at the moment. That's our company, you know. No, that's my company. I built it. The idea was mine. It has always been. I'm the smart one. Well, I'm the ambitious one. And I built that company to the point where it is right now. What have you done for it? I laid down the foundation of that company. I designed every idea you sit on. Me, me, me. And even back in prison, you always come to me to help figure out business strategies and opportunities. You're my brother. Is it not your job? Look, um, let's not act as if I haven't done anything for you. 
I had to pull almost all my resources to bring you out of jail, even before your time. That is not a favor. So what is it? I'll tell you what it is. It is my duty as your brother. And if I had to break through hell to bring you out and call that my duty as your brother, then it's also your duty as my brother to help me with my business ideas. So don't go thinking that this company is yours. It's mine and mine alone. I have my name on it and my name alone. Can I at least have some money? I need to get some new clothes. Um, yeah, I'll give you some money. Hey. I heard voices. I heard voices. Were you yelling at Gideon? No, we just um, we had a misunderstanding, but it's fine. So where is he now? Who? Gideon, of course. I don't know. Maybe his room or something. Or somewhere, I don't know. Okay, maybe I'll go check on him. Since when? Huh? I mean, since when did you start checking on Gideon? Gideon? Gideon, are you there? It's Lydia. I just want to make sure you're all right. Gideon? Gideon, it's me again. Do you want me to get you a drink or something? Lydia, can you just leave him alone? He's not responding. Isn't that a sign that he wants to be left alone? I guess. Gideon! Gideon, open the door, catch it! Yes? Come, come, come. I think something is wrong. Gideon, catch you, come, hurry. 
，客气，客气，不要动，我不能做不能吃，别动，别动，别动，别动，别动，别动。Call the go 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 call the driver. The driver. Okay. okay. Get Please don't. Stay with me. Please don't. Get him. Stay, Stay with me. Call the driver. Sorry if I scared you. No, 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 it's okay. Um, Clifford, what are you doing here? I boss asked me to get some clothes for a change of clothes for Boss Gideon. Gideon, is he dead? No, 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 he's not dead. Oh, oh sorry. I, I meant, is he all right? Yes, he's he's all right. I he will be discharged soon from the hospital. Thank God we rushed him to the hospital in time. Yes, yes, you're right. Um, okay, go ahead and, and get the clothes. Okay. I will clean up. It's in a great mess. Oh, I cleaned it up. You went into my room? Um, I had to... I had to clean the blood off the floor. I didn't touch anything. That's fine. It was a kind act.
What's wrong with you? You've been actually real strange since we got back this afternoon. Lydia. Babe. Gideon needs help. And this is not the place he's going to get it. What are you talking about? His wrist. He got overwhelmed and he acted out of impulse and he promised never to... Have you seen his body? That man is suicidal. He's done it before and he'll do it again. I don't know what you're talking about. How would you know what I'm talking about when you always turn a deaf ear to everything that I say? Well... If the man has scars all over his body, maybe he got it in prison. You know they beat themselves up in there. You're doing it again. Doing what? Turning a deaf ear. You're ignoring the truth. Your brother is sick. He's a bloody psychopath. Have you been to his room? His room looks like death. Stop this. Kachi, I will not live under the same roof as that man. I won't. So what do you want me to do now? Get him help. Send him to a psychiatrist so he can get the right help that he needs. There is nothing wrong with Gideon. There is absolutely everything wrong with Gideon. It's either he leaves or I leave. So now you won't talk to me this evening again, right? on my waist and on my butt? I am your brother-in-law. That's why it's okay to touch me that way? Hey, calm down. It's just a butt. Get the hell out of this kitchen. that what the hell is wrong with you bro why are you harassing my wife I didn't do anything Lydia can't be lying to me I don't know why she's lying but 
I didn't do anything to her. She's my wife. My woman. I said I didn't do anything to her. I didn't touch her. What? Why would I even do that? I'm, I'm not that bad, bro. I'm not. That's your wife. Your wife. I wonder why Lida is making up stories. It's all my fault. I must have scared her. But that doesn't mean she should cook up lies. Any woman in her shoes would do the same thing. No one wants to live with someone who attempts suicide. And you need to stop doing that. You only got lucky this time. I mean, you can't just slash your wrist at every disagreement we have. We are brothers. It is only normal that we disagree to agree. You didn't sound like you were ever going to agree. Gideon. I wouldn't bother you anymore. You can run the company all by yourself. You have your hands full. You're a talented artist. You've always been smart and intelligent. I'm sure you figure something out for yourself. I guess so. Hey, babe. I've sorted everything out. You know, I was thinking we should um, go out tonight to a nice restaurant and have dinner. Or maybe just uh, watch movies. You know, the way we used to do. <laughs> you know what? I think you should go out alone. Or with your friends. Just go shopping or to the beach. Just feel the cool breeze. <laughs> Oh, that reminds me. I sent your CV to some of my friends and they promised to get back to me. You just might be getting a call from them soon. <laughs> Sweetheart. I have to go to work, okay? I am. I already made it. 
I said I am not hungry. Please. Lydia, please. Leave me alone. Please don't let me eat alone. Please. Just leave me alone, Gideon. Leave me alone. Please open the door. Lydia, please open the door. Go away. I can't. I mean, I want to, but I can't. I'm your brother's wife. I and my brother used to share everything. We used to be best friends. And now we are not. He found you and everything changed. He doubts me now. He doesn't spend much time with me. You are now his best friend. I don't want to be his best friend. I'll tell him as soon as he gets back. Well, we can all be best friends, Lydia. Me. You. And Kachi. Just go. We can share everything together. You can't hide from me. Oh, Lydia. My darling. Open the door.
Don't you understand? I can't raise my child here. I, I need to leave. You're just being paranoid. I've lived with my brother for years and he has never posed as a threat. And then you came a few months ago and everything has changed? Trust me, I am not trying to cause a rift between you and your brother. I, I know he's your brother, but he is sick and he needs help. Enough! I can see that your hormones are getting the best of you. And I will just forgive this one time. It's not about... Sorry. I should have not. Yeah, well, it's okay. This might be too early, but... What other way than to celebrate the good news? Oh. I can't wait to be an uncle. Yeah, but we don't know if it's a boy or a girl yet. A toy is a toy. <laughs> ah, thank you. I'm going to order cake and pizza. Let's have a party. That won't be necessary. Thanks for the gift. But I'd appreciate if you stay away from me and my child from now on. Lydia. I beg you, in the name of God, or whatever it is that you serve, please stay away from me, my husband, and my child. Gideon, Gideon, Gideon. to abort the baby. What? Well, maybe you're not ready. And it's obvious I'm also not ready. What nonsense. Look, Lydia. I want my child to be safe too. And I will never risk my child's life for any reason. But my brother needs me. And if you think he's not fit enough to be around our child, then maybe we're not ready. Your brother is a grown-ass man. He can take care of himself. But he needs me. And we've been through a lot together. I don't expect you to understand. But trust me. Trust you! Trust you! Trust the man who wants me to kill his own child? Trust you, you say? Kachi, are you even listening to yourself? You want me to kill my child. Your child. Our child. Because you want your brother to continue to live under this roof. Well, I've got news flash for you. Whether or not I intend to keep this child, I will never live under the same roof as your brother.
Lydia. Lydia. Can't I talk to you? I'm not the enemy here. I'm your husband. I don't know what has gotten into you. This whole attitude thing is driving me crazy. You used to be understanding. Understanding? Yes, I am understanding. I'll have the baby. I'll carry the baby for nine months and hand the baby over to you so you can kill it. Oh, the thought drives you crazy? It does? Stop this. Stop what? Stop acting like you've gone crazy. I have gone crazy! You have made me go crazy! Your brother has made me go crazy! I am the crazy one living with a psychopath and a weakling of a husband! Don't insult me. Oh, what? Look, Lydia, just, just, just stop this. Don't provoke me. I'm trying so hard. <laughs> you are trying so hard? Do you even know the meaning of trying hard? I'll tell you. Get you sick, psychopath, brain sick, lunatic brother of yours to an asylum. Lydia. Feels like I'm haunted by demons from afar. They're getting closer. Dark shadows all around. <sighs> Just making sure you're safe. I dear. don't need you to make sure I'm safe. I Get want you to be safe. Get out! So I'm going to stay here and protect you. Lydia, don't stress yourself. You might hurt the baby. The baby. Just let me protect you.
Cacci! 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 Sir, please, let her take her medications as prescribed earlier. She will bounce on her feet. Okay? Okay. She'll be okay. Okay. Alright. Okay. I'll actually be on my way now. Alright. Okay, Doctor. Thank Bye. you. Thank you. My darling, I brought something nice for you. Oh. Oh. I made it myself. Your favorite. Okay? Say ah. Babe, if you don't eat, you fall sick. Please. I'm not interested. You've gotten what you wanted, right? I lost my baby. You should be happy. Sunshine, I didn't want you to get hurt. I didn't want this to happen to you, to us. I'm sorry. And I don't want to lose you too. Please just eat. Please.
you do, I promise you, I will kill you. I said, don't come any closer. I don't know why your brother has not seen the type of person you are. You are so deluded. Honestly, don't come any closer. Do not, don't come any closer. I said, stay back. Please, stop. I love you like my own sister. Why would I even want to harm you? Don't come closer. You are my dear brother's wife. I will stop you. Give me the knife. I don't want to hurt you! I promise you! I don't want to hurt you! Don't come close! I want to Somebody she will feel comfortable talking to. Oh, oh, she's not mad now. Oh, I'm not saying she's mad. See, anybody, any woman, in her shoes will do the same. She needs help. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. Let me, oh. let me call the doctor. Wait, wait, wait. Oh. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Oh. Oh. I'll call the doctor now. Oh. 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 I'll get the doctor. Oh. 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 My head. My head. Gachi, you look so moody. What? <laughs> She's punishing me again. He said that she's not going to give me any dinner today. <laughs> You're not saying anything. What do you want me to say? It's not like I can beat her. <laughs> she's a very wicked woman. And I don't want to be here anymore. I don't want to be here anymore. You need to take me out of here. I don't want to be here. Kachi, where do you want us to go? Do you know she's the only one that took us in after our parents died? Kidin, are you blind? Can't you see how she's maltreating us? She beats and punishes for no reasons. 
You know I'm smart, right? Don't worry. I'm going to make a lot of money. I'm going to build for us mansion. And I promise to take care of you. And give you the best life that you deserve. Stop crying. Stop crying. Why can't you? Stop crying. Stop crying, okay? Stop crying now. I don't see your money. I don't see your money. I don't your money. I don't see your money. I don't 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 Kachi, what? Kachi, what have you done? Look at me. Look at me. If anyone asks you who killed Auntie, tell that person it's me. That I'm the one that killed her because she was beating me. You hear me? You understand me? Come. I promise to protect you and to keep you and defend you. <laughs> Where is that? So what now? You're going to send me away to keep her. I hear your conversations. The walls are into that thick. You know I can't do that. She's going to make you do it. That's what women do. They make you do things you don't want to do. Remember, I made you you a promise to protect you always bro you know I've got your back but she has to go no I love her she's too sneaky she's going to ruin us you've been through a lot already she can't harm us she has already started she did this to me her back because I made a promise to protect you and she belongs to you what do you want me to do right now scare her away and she will leave you will get a new wife someone who can coexist with us Lydia is too rebellious
What do you want? Don't come any closer. I am warning you, Gideon. Don't come any closer. Don't come any closer. <laughs> Lydia to the visiting room. The husband is here to see her. Okay. This way, sir. Hi, Lydia. I'm sorry I couldn't come around last week, Thursday. Something came up. I'm trying to help you here. What else should I do? I don't know what to do. trying to help? How does this help? Haven't you done enough? You conniving, backstabbing son of a bitch. Lydia. I gave you everything. I gave you my life. And you stole it from me. At least you are alive. You call this leaving? Can't you ask you? You call this leaving? shadow of myself. I am being drugged day in, day out, every single day. I don't get to see my friends or my family. Tell me, how does this help? If I hadn't testified, it would have been to the gallows. And it would have been a much better life. Enough. Show some gratitude. The most dangerous animal is a silent, smiling woman. That I'm silent doesn't mean I'm stupid. I'm waiting for the right time. And that, Kachi, should scare the hell out of you. Mr. Kachi? Yes? Hi, my name Hello. is Bisola. Sola. Your wife's lawyer. Yes. Uh, uh, <coughs> um, Lydia has a new lawyer? <laughs> Apparently. She contacted me through an agency. She wants me to reopen her case. Oh, okay. I would like to visit the house. I hope you don't mind. Why? <laughs> oh, no. Just to talk. 4 p.m. Okay. Good. Thank you. All right. Have a nice day. All right. Bye. Gideon. Gideon. Lydia has a new lawyer. So? Lydia is reopening the case. That was expected. What do you mean that was expected? I mean, you asked me to testify that my wife is crazy so that they could confine her to a mental home. Why is she reopening the case? I mean, what if we get into trouble? <laughs> We've always been in trouble, little bro. Right from when our parents died and we were shipped off to stay with aunt to the point you killed aunt and I went to jail for it. Troubles have always followed us. You don't understand, bro. 
What if she found out that I stood in court, I lied to the judge, I looked my wife in the eye and I told the world that she's mentally unstable. Do you think she'll forgive me, kiss me or, or romance me? She won't. So let's try not to get caught. Um, anyway, um, her lawyer will be coming on Saturday. Should we come into the house? Then start acting normal. You're a goddamn liability. Those people are dangerous. I know, but I'm just going there to talk. Why not your office? Why does it have to be the house? If what you said about Gideon is true, I'd like to check it out myself. Yes. So, what's your plan? Kachi will receive an emergency call about work that he would have to leave the house. get run into the office, okay? Oh. Um, but Gideon, my brother, is coming down. Uh, he was the victim, and okay. um, I'm sure he's going to have answers to all your questions, okay? Uh, so you think we can reschedule? Of course. Okay, uh, nice to meet you again. See you again. Thank you, Marvin. And as for Gideon, one common thing about psychopaths is that they can never resist the charms of a vulnerable woman. That's where they find their triumph. You think he will fall? No. But I'm certain of one thing. What do he I would want to harm me. Poison or something. Kachi depends on him to make this problem go away. And that problem is me. Uh, of course. Uh, this is supposed to be an official set. You start something to Life is not that serious, please. Tell me about it. Actually, very professional. My job. My clients are my top priorities, but one wouldn't mind dripping. Oh, <laughs> dripping. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Sometimes. <laughs> oh. What do you want to know? I want to know 
everything. Up to the point she started. She was sick. Very sick. And we tried to get her help. What sort of help? Did you try talking to a psychologist about her? Or did you think about getting her into therapy? I'm guessing that's a no. What about when she lost her pregnancy? Did you and her husband... I think Kachi needs to be here. I don't know. I can answer all your questions. I know a lot. It's not that simple. That's a woman out there. Her life's been turned upside down. I'm, I'm trying to help her out. And I think you and your brother would like to have her home soon. Or maybe not. Oh, God! Are you alright? Uh, please, can I get a paper towel or something? That's just spilled. I'll be right back. He is an ex-convict. What if he had lynched on you that instant? Do you think I didn't think of that? The sleeping pill acted really fast. I knew this was against my work ethics, but damn those maniacs. I was determined to make them pay.
So what was in the diary? Hmm. Gideon had written about his time in prison and how he got to prison. I'm sure he really, really wanted to get it off his chest and that's why he had to write them down. In that diary, it was Kachi that killed your aunt and not Gideon, but he had to take the fall for it. I tell you something, both brothers would do anything to stick together, even if it means getting me out of the way. Sadly. Not to worry, it's time to go home. Both of them have been arrested and the judge confirmed that they had tortured you mentally, physically and otherwise. Everyone now knows what you did was in self-defense. You're free at last. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Oh, so I can finally go home now. Someone once said that hope is the best thing that can get us through the darkest of times. I was haunted like a rabbit, kept in a cage and fed with illusions. I guess this is a new beginning for me. A beginning after a night of storm. Like a phoenix, I will rise again. They're getting closer. Dark shadows all around. Something needs a right. It's getting closer. Feels like I'm losing my mind. They're reaching for my soul. Oh